How is it going guys? Back to another tutorial. It's been a while uh, since the last tutorial. I've been quite busy in the latest week. I'm gonna show you a tech trick which I call uh, monkey tech. Uh, just because I just have a monkey 47 gene bottle here. And this is inspired by Alexander Bakvarov. I leave the link in the description to his Instagram channel. He's making some very cool stuff. The trick looks like this. Not a easy trick for sure, this is an advanced tech trick. First thing you want to check your string tension is neutral, for we have a slack element at the end. Now to start off, we are going into a trapeze around our whole neutral end, and then we double on, missing the string towards us, like that. So you have this nice little flourish doing in one motion, like that. From here you want to stick your throw and index finger into the loop, and you want to intercept the top string. Now, from here, we are going to make uh, the double or nothing flourish that I use on a lot of my flow trick. So, we're going into a one and a half mount. Remember, uh, our whole non throw end is into the loop. With our non throw end index finger, we're going to undercut the rightmost string. And then we're going to undercut again to enter into a double or nothing. Remember, the whole on end is into the loop. Double or nothing, we're going to double on onto this string right here, and then just go back into the double or nothing. We're going to unmount the double or nothing by intercepting this top string with the yo-yo, and continuing the motion counterclockwise, we're going to hit this string into this sort of a kamikaze mount. From here, we're going to dismount and we're going to change our mount on our non throw end from our index finger to our thumb, like this. So we are into a sub mount on our non throw and thumb. From here we're going to into a one and a half mount, like this. And now we are going to undercut the yo-yo onto the rightmost string with our whole non throw end, like this. Now here comes the tricky part. We are going to undercut the yo-yo with our throw and index finger, unmounting it, and while we are we unmount from this mount, we are going to land on the string attached to our yo-yo finger, like that. With our thumb fingernail, we are going to uh, intercept this string attached to the yo-yo bearing and we're going to pull it out towards us. Then we want to intercept this top string with the yo-yo to enter this mount. From here, roll the yo-yo clockwise, um, unmounting it from the front and keeping this loop around your uh, throw and index finger. So basically, while you are mounting the yo-yo, you are rolling around your throw and index finger and the loop will be created here. Continuing the motion, we want to land the yo-yo onto this bottom string. And here comes a flourish with our throw and index finger, we want to Undercut the yo-yo and land onto this string right here. And then we want to come back, curling our throw and index finger in. Yeah. 
now stick our throwing index finger out and we want to go around the outer cup of the yo-yo from the front like this. Then take your non-throw and the last three fingers and reject this string right here from the inner cup of the yo-yo. You want to intercept this string with the yo-yo gap, or better, intercept the yo-yo gap with this string attached to your throw and index finger like this, so you are into this sort of a bucket. Stick your index finger on your throw and uh, right upon the yo-yo gap. You have this two string in this V formation that is formed here. You want to intercept only the string closest to you with the yo-yo gap, like that. Release your thumb, your uh, non-throwing thumb, then you want to pass around the yo-yo like this, pinch here on your index finger and intercept this lack on the other side. And you want to go under the yo-yo, let go with your um, index finger, amount, you are in a trapeze, and you can buy it. I hope that you find this video interesting and useful. This is a quite an advanced trick, so take your time to practice it. And then when you did it, tag me into Instagram and let me know how it goes. Till the next one, I am Diego B. Thanks for having spent a bit of time with me today. So long.